Why underhook his arm? That's so important. If you're a cyclist, you have to underhook that arm. Why? Do you remember? Because his escape is, if he gets that arm, if he underhooks me with his arm, and he turns onto his side, he's already out. He's out. Bang! He has my back, and I don't, I don't end in a good position at all. So when I'm here on him, again, I'm not like this. My knees are on the ground. He can't feel it. My knees are up. I'm not like, I'm not down on the stomach. Because he's, he's grand there. She's grand, grand there, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So I want to be here as tight as possible. Push him into the ribs tight. Now, the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to grab this hand and push it down to the floor. I'm not, Brian is going to the gym after this, right? He's going to be horsing around serious weights, right? So I'm not going to get into an arm. And he's got bigger biceps and biceps than me. So I'm not going to get into an arm wrestle. Ryan. I'm not going to go strength strength. When I push Ryan's arm down, I'm going to push down my body weight. So that's what I'm going to push down. See, so I even use my head. I want to make sure I push it down on my weight. Okay, so anytime you go for a hand, I don't want just like a two of us like this to go. Like, whoever gets it, gets it. Oh, I don't want to play fair. If I play fair, I might win. I want to use every advantage I can. So as soon as I separate an arm, as soon as I have this here, as soon as I get this hand here, I'm not pushing it down like this. I'm pushing it down my body, my body works. This hand goes onto my wrist. I'm still squashing the bejesus out. Of my I might do one. I'm actually practicing out for my knees, give them a break, right? First thing I do to make this immediately horrible is that all I do is tighten up. That's all I do. That alone is nearly enough to make some tap. Because uh, if it's loose like this and I start putting on, it's not as good. I tighten up my grip. The next thing I'm going to do is paint the floor with his knuckles as I lift slightly with this hand. Uh, obviously, if you're, on the, if you're on the arm and he's about to tap, grand. But even when you have your hand, you instinctively they'll reach over. You might reach for my hand, you might reach. Remember that's what I was saying, snake around. Once I'm here, kick the leg over, grab my own hand, and motion on to get it to me from there. When 